Hey everybody, and welcome back to part 41 of the Let's Play The Sims 3. All in one, you're probably wondering, why are you playing this anymore? I thought you were going to take a break. Well, I miss this family, guys. I have really missed it. So what I did was I uninstalled and reinstalled all of my expansion packs. I reinstalled all my store content, and I reinstalled the custom content that I want. Um, so I c completely cleared out everything. Um, and then for some reason, when I would went to go load up Mesa Grande, which was the town that they were living in, everything was like shifted to the right. Like all of the lots were on top of the like the uh, road. It was just really weird. So. Um, I decided to pick up and move them to Appaloosa Plains, and their family, their dads and cousins and whatever else they had, are not in this um, neighborhood, sadly, but I didn't want to bring them back just in case they had something on them that was glitched, you know, so um, or messed up or corrupted, so I didn't want to have to really worry about that. So I just took the main family, which is this family right here, and plopped them down. So I'm pretty much going to say that we moved and we have no contact with our family because we kind of disowned them, pretty much, okay? Um, so they live in Appaloosa Plains and, and in this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful house that Joey made for me. I will post his YouTube in the description. Um, he is an awesome LPR as well, and he apparently is an awesome builder that I didn't know he has killed. But I, he, he made this, uh, this house for me and it is gorgeous. Um, so with everything, um, having to get shifted over and everything getting deleted, I did have to reset the age because I had to bring them into create a sim. So no one's really up to, um, aging up quite yet. Whoopsies, wrong button. Um, so I want to go ahead and show you this, um, Sorry if you guys can hear my mic. I have to get used to, because I just got a, or not my mic, but my mouse. I just got a brand new desk, so I have to rearrange the setup and everything like that. So it's going to take a little bit to get used to. And plus I'm going to get like a, um, like a mic stand. So it's up in the air and off of my desk and stuff like that this month. Alright, so this room is going to be Mark's and I think it's Mark, yeah, Mark and Wendy's room. It's kind of girly, I know, but um, like I said, Wendy is going to be one of those popular kids that just, who cares, you know? And this, if you guys can't tell, is going to be um, Finley's and Patricia's room. And then down here, if you guys can't tell, all of them have bathrooms on them, so we have plenty of bathroom, plenty of showers, plenty of toilets to go around. Um... So down below, this is going to, be, going to be Tyler's room. It's kind of sophisticated, but you know you got to put on a um, put on a show for your lovers because he's going to be one of those. He's going to play a player. I've decided that he's going to be a full blown player. Um, I'm going to give him the lifetime wish for the like the woohoo in five different spots, um, the heartbreaker one or whatever. And over here is going to be Janelle's room. I didn't have much money to go for um, because. You know, we have $3,000 or simoleons. So, um, this is Janelle's room. And down below is Aiden's room. Again, it's not the most spectacular, but it still has a bathroom added onto it. Um, and if you guys can't tell, we don't have, um, we don't have, uh, Dennis or, um, Oogsway, but I'll, I, I may add them back in. I'm not sure, but we are going to get a, um, a bird, of course. And then over here is kind of like the main bathroom. Um, I absolutely love the kitchen that he made. Um, I don't remember where exactly all of these are, all of the content is from, but it is awesome. Just saying. It is awesome. Like, I absolutely love it. And then we have the dining room right here, and then the living room. And then out here we have the pool area along with the slide, a barbecue, a little um, seating area. And then over here is all for Oreo. Why can't I think of his name? All for Oreo. Um, he has the stall over here. Um, and then we have a salt lake over here. And then we have just this area for him to run around, which is awesome. Um, so... 
let's go ahead and get started so i believe that we have the no bills ever trait yes we do not trait but um lifetime reward so tyler is gonna go ahead and stock up um that bird cage because we need a bird because we just got our bird and then all of a sudden we got rid of it and you know we should probably have a bird now <laughs> So I'm going to go ahead and get the blue gold Macau again. Um, so make sure you fill up the food as well. <laughs> I got to reposition myself. My foot is falling asleep. Okay. <clears throat> Much better. Much better. Alright, so I want to go ahead and have... Um, Janelle, go ahead and finish. I believe we started teaching Mark how to talk. Um, go ahead and finish Mark how to talk. Um, so go ahead and do that. And then I'm going to have Finley actually work on getting Oreo and his skill up. Um, so go ahead and feed a tree, talk to, rub neck, hug, let sniff hand and then brush and clean hooves there we go I want to check something really fast because I did have this issue where it would take a year and a half for interactions yeah it's still there but that's okay um but I did change Patricia's look a little bit this is a brand new hair from Momo Moo Moo I believe it's a retextured from a hair from the sims through resource i believe um but it is gorgeous and then this is anubis's brand spanking new um dress that she just made or he just made um so i decided to give it to her but um hopefully everyone's relationships are per pretty good they're, they're the best they can be at least um i'm gonna go ahead and look um at the family tree but I do have Marcel saved in the saved sims so I may play plop him down but we're not going to be related to him because I don't have any mods installed except for a lighting mod and some create a sim um sliders and stuff like that so nothing to really interfere with the gameplay um just because I wanted to leave the mods out for a little while and just play the game so I don't have master controller installed so I can't make them a family if I put them in there sadly so but I'm going to go ahead and actually let him mount the horse afterwards. Go ahead and fast forward. Oh, they're so cute. My nose is like watering. Oh, stupid mascot. I completely forgot about you. Get away from here. We're not going to university quite yet. But I did plan on, um, I do plan on, um, going to university and the future and stuff like that. Just because I have those expansion packs installed. I have every expansion pack and stuff pack installed, if you guys can't tell. Everything's plopping up. But I'm going to sell this. Actually, I'm just going to put it in our family inventory. I'm not going to sell it. Um, put it in our family inventory. That way we don't have to go into buy the bug and buy it again. So I'm going to leave it in our family inventory. He wants to get a part-time job. Ooh, awesome. Um, Golden, no. Definitely not. Be best friends with Oreo. Of course we can try and be best friends with Oreo. Oreo, we're almost there, actually. Um, so we can be that. We can do that. Sing karaoke, buy a street art. Oh, great. Oh, well, he'll get another wish to have a part-time job. So no worries. I'm like starving. My tummy keeps growling. It's like 9.20 a.m. right now. I woke up at like 7 a.m. just to work on my game so I could try and get me to be able to play it again because I miss playing The Sims 3. I really do. Um, I don't know why. I keep telling myself, I'm not going to play that stupid game anymore. I'll, all I have is trouble. Hey, dude. Hey. You kind of got on there backwards. He's like, I don't know what happened, dude. I just, I just, I just tried to get on my horse. It's kind of backwards, dude. Good job. Good job, Finley. 
There you go. Are you kidding me, mascot? So here's the mascot, guys. Um, Roman Fountain. Interesting. He's not too bad looking, but no. It's not happening. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and... Let's go ahead, because since we are in Appaloosa Plains, we have the Equestrian Center and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and enter Equestrian Center racing competition for beginner. Since we can enter those now, and I do have the Equestrian Center in here, we might as well go and do that. He's still, he's still kind of confused when he rides on a horse. Plus, he, the horse is going extremely fast, but... That's so funny. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and fast forward it so they can get there fast. I thought that the events only happen at like 5pm. Or is it because it's special because it's Sunday? I have no idea. thought it was only at 5pm, but whatever. We're, we're going to race an event, so that's okay. Um... All right, here we go. Okay. Come on, are you? We haven't started yet, though. There we go. Okay, let's go for broke. Come on, come on, are you? Come on, come on, are you? Third place, we can do better. Third place, keep it or go up to first. I'd like it if you go up to first. No, 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 no. I don't like ninth place. No tenth place. What the heck? Ooh, that's a pretty horse. Fourth place. Fourth place. Sixth place. What are you doing, Oreo? Okay. Fourth place. Fifth place. Go for broke. No. Seventh place. Not happening. Fifth place. Come on, Oreo. Come on, Oreo. Come on. Come on, Oreo, come on. Come on, Oreo, come on. Come on, Oreo. Yay! We came in second place. How exciting is that? Uh, it looks like Oreo has really taken a liking to Finley. He has chosen Finley as his BFF. Congratulations, Finley has just improved his riding skill to level 3. Finley may now enter a question center show jumping competitions. Congratulations, Oreo, written by Finley Underwood, has placed second in... Vagen Cup. Vagen Cup. Enjoy your prize money. Oh, yes. Yes, please. Some people say that Gracie Loveland has a terrible guilty secret. Could it really be true? Ooh. What is this? Okay. Let's go ahead. Can we not enter anymore? Next competition. Oh, what is that? Wait, what? Breed mare. Oh, ooh. Okay. I do have some horses saved in my saved sim bin that I will try and um, put in this world. I want to have them. I want to get another horse. That's what I want to do. Um, but we just don't have enough room to do that. So I'm not sure how that's going to work. But let's go ahead and go across the street and come over here and train Oreo for racing. Um, so we're going to go ahead and do that. And then we can go ahead and practice jumping. I believe Oreo does not like jumping, hates jumping. So we need to train him not, not to hate it. All right, so I'm going to go over to everyone else. I believe Janelle finished teaching him how to uh, talk. So let's go ahead and teach him how to walk, Janelle. Go ahead and teach to walk. Teach Mar Mark to walk, of course. Alright. And Aiden, my friend. I got this really, really cute um, skin, if you guys can't tell. It's from Burnt Waffles. It's a blueberry pie. And I believe Sim Sweetie uses this skin a lot. I got it from her because I actually I absolutely adore it. And I needed a new default skin because my default skin that I had for some reason just wasn't working 
I'm not sure why. I I just didn't get it. But um, I got a new custom content default skin. So um, they're all playing with their imaginary friends, and it's kind of kind of annoying because they are not going to be turned real. <laughs> How cute! All right, what is Patricia doing? Doing that. Um, I am going to have her still be a singer. So I want to make sure that we have um, some places to go for the singer career. Um, and if, like I said in the beginning, I will not be installing mods back into my game for quite some time. Um, just until I get a new computer so my computer can actually handle it. Um, so, just so you guys know. But she's going to be a fairy singer. How adorable. Alright, so let's go ahead and check up on them. They're doing pretty good, I think. Racing. Basic racing. Let's go ahead and do a jockey training. I'm not sure what that is. They're all watching us. Do you see that? They're watching us. Congratulations, Oreo just improved his racing skill to level 4. Oreo will now feel especially satisfied after a good race training session. Ooh. Nice. Alright, so now they're gonna go... Oh, nope. Nope, they're gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep going until he learns another skill point, I believe. It's almost done. Yeah. There we go. Alright, so go ahead and practice jumping now, because he needs to... He needs to... Oreo needs to know that jumping is not that bad. Um, see? Did I do that? Okay, go over here. That's too big for you, I think. Unless you have to do that. Okay, I was like, I don't know why it's making me do that. Because there's no... There we go. Go, Oreo. It's your birthday. Go, Oreo. It's your birthday. Okay. What is this? Um, win a beginner racing competition. Of course, of course, of course. All right. Aw, oh, good job, Oreo. You're doing so good. All right, what's wrong with Mark? Um, Janelle, you're teaching him how to walk, so you're good. Who is this? Some random dude just just sitting out here watching us teach our kid how to freaking walk. 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 What a creeper. Some horses might be content to stay on the ground, but Oreo has taken a different path. Becoming a skilled jumper will take a lot of practice on different jumping obstacles and courses, but with dedication and the right rider, Oreo could become an equestrian legend. Ooh, lovely, lovely. Alright, so Patricia, I want you to come over here and uh, fiend Wendy. So go ahead and feed on the floor. What about Aiden? Aiden's pretty hungry too, so... Feed Aiden on the floor as well. And then Janelle, once you're done, go ahead and um, feed on the floor. And Tyler, can I trust you to make some food or would that be bad? Let's go ahead and try. Um, go ahead and serve up some macaroni and cheese. Why does everyone want to learn the gardening skill? I don't understand. Alright, so once Finley reached level 6 of the writing skill, um, sure thing, Buster. Okay, let's go ahead and head on home. Um, so we're going to go ahead and go on home because he has a saddle sore. Spending a lot of time on the back of a horse tends to leave quite an impression on one's backside. Ouch, from riding horse. So he can go ahead and go on home because I don't want him to have to ride a horse all freaking day, even though it's been all freaking day anyways, but <laughs> who cares? Alright, so go ahead and stop teaching him how to walk and feed him, please. Because he's hungry, apparently. Don't. He's cooking. Alright, so Finley, you can go ahead and unmount Oreo. Dismount. Sorry. 
And Patricia, let's go ahead and put all the babies in the crib. So go upstairs, put uh, Mark in this crib. Actually, let's do Wendy first. Put Wendy in this crib. Janelle, you can put, uh, put Mark in that crib. And then Patricia, go ahead and put Aiden in that crib. There we go. Even though he didn't really eat and he's really, really stinky, but that's okay. Aww. All right, Oreo, you can have a sigh of relief. What is this? I'm thirsty. You know that dry, still feeling when you're really thirsty? Well, Oreo could use some fast water so you can, so you can avoid that feeling. All right, so go ahead and come over here and drink some water. And what is this? Um, unsaddle me. Training fatigue. Learning something new can be exhausting. Of course it can be exhausting. Alright, so after you drink some, you can go ahead and nap. Okay. And Finley, did you finish? Or not Finley, but Tyler, did you finish? Yes, you did. Go ahead and call entire household to the mill. Alright, and there's the lag. That's okay. <laughs> it is 10 times better than the lag I did have. So, just keep that in mind, guys. 10 times better than the lag I did have. I'm gonna have her put him in the crib first. And then you can go ahead and come over here and eat. Uh, so grab a bowl. Oh, shut it, Aiden. Or Mark. Really? <laughs> fine okay okay stop crying let's go ahead and change dirty diaper and then go ahead and feed back on the floor since apparently he didn't eat fast enough so all right so everyone's gonna go eat but I'm gonna go ahead and end this part right here so I hope you guys are excited this is that this is back um, there is no way, shape, or form that this is going to be ending anytime soon. So, keep that in mind that there's going to be more parts coming. And I have so much I want to do with this family. So much I can do with this family that I know for a fact that it won't be ending anytime soon. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this part. And I hope you guys have a awesome, 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 awesome day. And I will talk to you guys all in my next video. Bye, everyone.